Welcome back to Fab Automotive Detailing, you guys. In this video, we're gonna take a look at Amsoil Synthetic Lubricants. Let's do it. So before we get this video started, you guys, take a second, go down below the video, hit that subscribe button, make sure you smash that thumbs up. A lot of people don't understand what the thumbs up does. The more thumbs up you get on a, on a video, the more it's offered to other people across the YouTube platform. So it really helps channels grow. So if you can do that, I'd greatly appreciate it. And then make sure you turn on the little bell so that every time I upload a video, you do get notified. So I've been an Amsoil user, guys, for years. I absolutely love their products. When I first decided to take the leap and start using Amsoil products, I researched them for a long time. I was back and forth, back and forth, back and forth on what I wanted to do. Amsoil is one of those things that is a love or hate thing in the automotive world. Either you know about them, you use their products, and you absolutely love them, and you see the benefit of them, or People are gonna get mad at me for saying this. You're an Amsoil hater, you've never used their products, but you see the prices and you think, oh, there's no way I'd ever use that, blah, blah, blah. Oil is oil. Well, that is not true. Oil is not oil. And I'm gonna put a plug out there for Project Farm. His YouTube channel, you guys, he put up, this is a couple years ago, a ton of oils up against each other. Um, he is unbiased, he has no um, affiliation with any of the companies. And there were some oils in there that really surprised me how high they placed. Um, when the testing was over with and some of the oil surprised me how low they they placed um, when the testing was over with but amsoil came out number one on top of every single one once again he's not affiliated with them um, but it was very cool video so i would go check that out forever you guys if you're kind of on the fence now i was already an amsoil user at that point but it was interesting to me to see the products that i'm using how are they stacking up against the others um, in the automotive world and it just it killed it. Amsoil killed it um, in all of his tests, you guys. So go check that video out. Amsoil definitely is very beneficial. I have seen it in every single thing that I use it in. As you guys can see, this is what I use from Amsoil. Uh, there's actually more things that aren't here that I've already used that I'm out of stock of that I've already, like PI, it's one. It's a fuel cleaner. Um, that's a product that I use a lot and I'm just out of it right now so I didn't have it put out here. Um, but I use it in anything that I own that has an engine. Anything that needs grease, like my polishers, I will use the, the Amazon grease right there in all of my polishers. Um, my lawnmowers, the four-wheeler, uh, four motorcycles, our cars, trucks, my diesel van. Um, we have a Gator, it gets Amazon also. All of my wheel bearings on my trailers, uh, camper, they get packed with the Amazon grease. There's nothing that I own mechanical that doesn't have Amazon on it in some way, shape or form. So when I decided back in December of last year, so about five months ago, to become an Amsoil dealer, because I was on the fence about that for a long time, because I've been a preferred customer for a very long time. Um, when I decided to become a dealer, I said, you know what, I'm eventually gonna go and let my YouTube followers know about it. And so I got a website built, um, it is up and it's ready. We'll talk about that here in a minute. This is actually my website for the detail supplies, but as you notice, there's an Amsoil right here on the side on the main page where you guys can go and click it. It takes you to my Amsoil website um, and then you guys can check this stuff out for yourself. So where I have noticed Amsoil being the most beneficial for me um, is their oils, especially. I mean, everything that I use from them is fantastic, but their oils is where I saw the change. Um, what I noticed immediately, engine oil temperatures went down, engine oil pressure went up. Both of those are very good things when it comes to your engine. The other thing is Amsoil is 100% synthetic. And I'll show you right here in the bottom. I know they are, I've done all my research, but it says right there on the bottle, 100% synthetic. Compared to other companies that are full synthetic, there is a difference. Amsoil makes everything in these bottles, 100% synthetic. That's what that means, 100% man-made. Full synthetic is a conventional type of oil that has additives put into it and a synthetic oil of some sort put into it and they call it full synthetic. It can be as low as 25% synthetic and 75% conventional in some of these big box brands um, that are calling it full synthetic. So it's not really full synthetic. Amsoil is 100% synthetic and that's another thing that really drew me uh, to Amsoil. So another place that Amsoil shines for you guys is their oil change intervals. Um, that's where it really got me because that's the main concern people always have is, is price and I get it, um, especially in this economy today. Um, price, but it actually saves you money by using their products. Their oil change intervals are really high. So on my personal vehicles, I go one year 
without changing the oil. But we only put 10 to 12,000 miles a year on our vehicles. Um, and I change the oil filter every six months. So that, depending on what vehicle I'm doing it on, so like uh, our Jeep, I think is like $80 or something like that for the oil change, but that's for an entire year. I'm not doing three or four oil changes a year like I used to before I switched to AMS oil. So I'm actually saving money um, by doing just one oil change a year and then putting one filter on. And I like to use the AMS oil filters on my vehicles if it is offered for my vehicle. The Signature Series oil right here is guaranteed protection for up to one year or 25,000 miles. The XL is guaranteed for up to one year or 20,000 miles now. This is the old bottle, the new bottle, they are 20,000 mile new formula. Um, and the Diesel Signature Series is guaranteed one year, 25,000 miles. So you have that long drain interval if you choose to do that. And you can also buy an oil analysis kit. If you're not sure, if you go 10,000 miles, you're like, hey, I wonder how my oil is doing. And you can pull it out, put it in the kit and you mail it, you buy it off the website and it's pre uh, postage paid and everything once you buy it and you send it in and they'll send you an analysis back and let you know, you know, what your oil looks like, how it's how it's working, how clean it is, um, but letting you know if you can keep it in basically, um, if it's starting to wear out, should you change it, all that good stuff. Um, if you're not sure, I've never done that personally because I don't drive enough to do that. So 10 to 12,000 miles, I'm happy with. I check my oil usually about once a month uh, if I need to top off. When I switched to AMS oil, I found that I wasn't topping off my oil as much as I used to because it's not burning like it used to with conventional oil, um, which is a very good thing. I want to go ahead and go over the website really quick. It's really simple, but I want to show you guys um, the new addition to the website so you guys can check it out for yourself. I will put a link in the description under the video um, where it'll take you directly to the AMS oil website for, for my website. And then from there, when you click on something, it takes you to the AMS oil website. I know that doesn't sound um, right, but AMSOIL does not allow us to put prices on our website. When you click on it, it has to go to theirs. But what that does is it takes my dealer number and once you're on that website, anything that you buy, um, I basically get the credit for. Now, if you decide to become a preferred customer, it's $10 every six months or $20 a year. You will save that in your very first oil change, I promise you, um, because you're gonna get up to 25% off on what you buy. It's worth it. I was a preferred customer for, <laughs> I don't know how long, for a long time, you guys definitely worth um, the, the $20 a year to be the preferred customer. Your prices will be on there. Once you sign up for that, you become my customer. I am your dealer at that point. Um, and if you ever have any questions, you can call me. The phone number is on the website and we can talk it through and figure out what you might need for your vehicle. I have no problem doing that. But I wanna show you guys really quick. Let's go over the website really fast. Um, and then I'm gonna kind of show you what I use personally and that'll be about it for the video. Now I know this may not be crystal clear because it's you're, I'm videotaping a LED TV guys, but uh, right here, when you go to the website, it shows Amazon right next to contact us. Now, if you're on the cell phone, there's three little dots, dashes, you click that and it's below contact us, but it'll take you directly to the website. So if you decide to go this route, I will put the website directly in the description of the box or under the video, you guys click on AMS oil. That's going to take you to my new page. This is it right here, Fabulum of Detailing LLC. And then it has phone number and everything up at the top, independent dealer. And as you scroll down, I mean, you can sit here and you can watch this. It has some stuff on it, which is pretty cool. It's better on the computer, but just kind of show you. As you scroll down, you can uh, go in here and hit auto light truck, motorcycle, ATV, UTV, snowmobile, marine outboard, PWC, small engine, and heavy duty. If you continue, and what you do, if you click on, let's say you want to look up your vehicle, that's going to take you directly to Amazon's website, which I'll show you. Then three tiers of performance. This is your main gasoline engine oil, your synth, uh, signature series, your extended life, and then your OE. OE is your no normal OE drain intervals, by the way. As you grow down, it's going to just have some other stuff, but I want to show you right here, you have you can request a free catalog. You click on that, it'll take you to Amazon's website, request a free catalog. They are one of the few companies today that still give you an actual catalog quarterly that has all their products with prices, USPC, Canadian PC, um, everything that they had, I have pages folded because I buy from them all the time. Um, and it, it's a really cool catalog. Everything that they sell is in that catalog. If you come down here, it's under my wife's name, April, you guys. If you come down here, um, where is it at? Right here, membership, become a preferred customer. You can do this here or at the top of the screen. So let's click on that, I wanna show you. This is where you sign up to be my customer, right here, and then you hit join now. And then from there, it's pretty easy. Um, you shouldn't have to put my, my dealer number in to, uh, to become a preferred customer. It should already do it automatically, but if it doesn't, I will put it down in the description of the video so you guys can find my dealer number. It's 559-7673, you guys. Um, but yeah, so I'm gonna show you, 
Let's exit out of here. So what you're gonna do, you're gonna click your auto and light truck. And then from here you pick, you know, what you have. So let's just do my truck. Let's do a 2018. Uh, where's Ram Ram? This is where people are gonna say, you, you own an Eagle Diesel, those are junk. Um, three liter Eagle Diesel. Now, this is where you can buy a kit. It's gonna come with your oil filter and as many quarts of oil that your vehicle actually needs. This one would come with 11 quarts, you guys, of 5W40. Um, and then down here, your retail price is 137, and that's for 11 quarts and a filter, but if your preferred customer, it's 102. You already saved your $20 right there for your preferred customer discount. But everything that you need for your car right here, here's your engine oil. This is what I use for my truck, Signature Series 540. That's a fantastic oil. They're all good, but I love the Signature Series. It does a very good job of cleaning, especially in diesels. Then here's your oil filter. They have air filters. And then down here, whatever coolant uh, you need for your vehicle, anything that's made for your vehicle, here's the Signature Series oil for your vehicle. You don't have to guess that way. Like, what do I need to use for my differential? What do I need to use for my transfer case? Um, and then here's gear loop, severe gear. So everything you need for your vehicle is down there, like their brake fluid right there. I love their brake fluid. It makes, it gives me such a good brake pedal when I do a brake fluid exchange. And then just all kinds of different stuff. Um, so you can do that here on the website. You can sign up to be a preferred customer. Uh, and you don't have to be a preferred customer, but you save money immediately uh, versus paying full price. Like I said, you'd pay 137.26 on the website if you weren't a preferred customer. Why not spend $20 and spend 122, so you're still saving $15. Um, over that. So all the prices are different as you go throughout the website, but I just want to go and hit, get, go ahead and give you guys that rundown exactly how to use um, their website. Now that was a quick rundown of the website, you guys. It's a very simple website to use. When you go to mine, once you click something, it's going to take you to Amsoil. Um, and then from there, it's pretty self-explanatory of looking up your vehicle or what engine you, oil you want to do and all that good stuff. Just go explore, check it out, check out the prices, you guys, and you'll see how much money you can really save. Now I want to go over the products that I use. Um, the reason I decided to become a dealer is I've used their products long enough now that I believe that I know enough about them that I can definitely have no problem selling them and talking to people about them. Do I know everything about every product they sell? Absolutely not. There's still stuff I'm learning on. I don't know hardly anything about the marine stuff, you guys, um, but pretty much everything else I have either used or I've done enough research on that I feel confident enough that I can sell it. That's why I decided to become a dealer. Start off with their engine oil, which is where I started. Um, the great thing about Amsoil, you guys, when I first started using Amsoil, there wasn't a whole lot of information out there. There was some, but not a ton like there is now. So everything I bought was trial and error. That's why I decided to start with their engine oils. And there was no errors. It was all trial and everything worked the way that it should. Now, when you buy something from a company, whether it's a product for cleaning your car or this or a tool or something for your kitchen, whatever, in your life, and it says it's gonna do this, this, and this, and you buy it, you spend your harder money on it and find out, well, it doesn't do this or this. It's supposed to. That's so disappointing. Amsoil is going to tell you their oil or their fuel injector cleaner or whatever, it's going to do this, 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 and this. And guess what? It's going to do everything that it says that Amsoil says it's going to do because they test and test and test and make sure that it's going to do what it says it's going to. I have not been let down by a single Amsoil product, you guys, to date, and I have tried a lot of their products. So over here are my engine oils. Um, starting with this one. This is my small engine oil. This is what I use in all of my mowers. Um, the Gator, anything that has a small engine, this is what I use in it. And I'm using the 10W30. And I can tell you, everything's quieter. And you're going to hear me say that a lot in this video. Everything that I put Amsoil oil in, the engine quiets down and you can tell it doesn't run as hot. Or in a car, you can actually see if you have an oil temperature gauge that it's not running as hot and your oil pressure goes up. In my cars, it depends on what car I'm servicing. If I am doing one of our nice cars, you guys, I always go with Signature Series right here. Now this is their top tier oil, you guys. 75% um, more wear protection. This, this oil here is, does a great job at keeping the inside of your engine clean. Every car that I've put it in has been quieter. The engine, even the even the engines I had that I thought were quiet were even quieter at that point because I put Signature Series also in my diesel truck. And I can tell you when I bought the truck, it had regular oil in it from whatever the dealership put in it. And I always thought it was kind of loud and then I flushed it like I always do. And then I put signature series diesel, heavy duty diesel oil in it. You guys, that diesel engine runs quieter and has a lot more fuel or oil pressure than it did before. Um, that's why I love signature series oil. It does exactly what it says it's going to do on here. Six times more wear protection. 
Um, let's see, it says maintains proper viscosity, minimizes oil consumption, maximizes fuel efficiency, and it does because I do get better miles per gallon out of anything I put signature series in. Excels in extreme temperature, controls soot thickening on, on the diesel, which is great, especially on the truck I have. Um, compatible with petroleum and synthetic diesel oils. Now this, if you're like off-road service, it's crazy. Pro protects up to three times the OEM recommended, recommended service life, not to exceed 60,000 miles or one year on heavy duty off-road applications. Up to two times OEM recommendation service life on, on your cars or trucks, 25,000 miles or one year, which is what they recommend with Signature Series. Now XL, and I wanna show you guys, this is the new label. This is the old label. This one is good for 20,000. This one's good for 12,000. This is what I ran in our stuff for a little while when I first started using Amsoil products, I ran Amsoil XL oil. So now I decided once I started using XL oil and seeing the benefits I got from it, that's when I bumped it up to signature series on our, our nicer vehicles and what I would say are nicer vehicles. Um, XL goes into the vehicles that I don't have a bunch of money in, um, I don't wanna spend a bunch of money on them, but I can still go that one year without having to worry about changing oil. That's the biggest thing, it's finding time to change oil. That's one of the main reasons I wanted to go to AMS oil is I ran out of time. I, I just got tired of changing the oil three or four times a year because being a mechanic, you see the benefits when you're using conventional oil of, yeah, you really do need to change it every three or 4,000 miles. You need to stay on top of it. These people have these gauges in their car that say 15,000 miles. That's a terrible idea. And that's why people have so many engine problems. Just do what the manufacturer recommends, unless it's AMS oil, do what AMS oil recommends and you will be fine if you stay on top of it. Inside my van, which is my work van, you guys, for the business, I use the diesel oil turbo truck. This is their heavy duty diesel oil. What I like about this, you guys, is for the business, it's priced really well. I can buy it in two and a half gallon increments because mine holds 13 quarts. So I buy two of these plus a gallon, which gives me 14 quarts. So that gives me that extra oil or that extra quart of oil to top off with periodically because that is an 08 diesel. And like I've always heard and said my entire life as a mechanic, if it's a diesel and it's not leaking oil, it ain't got no oil in it. Um, so I always like to have that extra amount of oil for top off. And I do, on all the vehicles that I use the Signature Series in, XL in, or even in my lawnmowers, I check my oil monthly just to make sure, but I have noticed that they don't burn nearly as much oil as they did before I ever switched to AMS oil. Um, just so many different things from AMS oil that you get, that, that you benefit from. So flush. Flush is um, what I use anytime I have a car, like our Yukon that we just got. I'll be using flush, flush the engine out, and then I'm gonna change my oil, and it's gonna be good to go from there, and I won't have to worry about flushing it ever again. Diesel recovery and diesel all-in-one. So these are what I use in the diesels. Diesel recovery is if you have gelled oil in the wintertime, or gelled oil, if you have gelled fuel in the wintertime and the, your car won't start, your diesel won't start, you're gonna pour that in your fuel filter, pour it in your gas tank, start it, let it run, and it should help thaw all that gel fuel and get you back on the road and get you going. Diesel all-in-one is a cetane boost, an injector cleaner, and it is a winter additive to keep it from your fuel from gelling, but I use it year round. Uh, it is two ounces for five gallons of fuel um, is, what, is what that is right there. And I have had zero issues with my diesels ever since I started using that. Then over here we have gasoline additives, stabilizer pretty much speaks for itself, you guys. It's what I use in my mowers, the gator, the four-wheeler, the, the motorcycle um, for winter storage, anytime I'm storing anything. Gasoline additive, upper cylinder lubricant. This, this product here, you guys, is pretty new from them. Um, it's gonna keep the upper cylinder lubricated because most cars have a problem with that, but it's also gonna clean your fuel injectors. Quick shot is what I use in all of my small equipment, mowers or whatever to help fight ethanol problems because mowers, especially if they have a carburetor, they have a problem with ethanol fuel, that's gonna help you with that. And it's also a stabilizer, but not as stout as regular stabilizer, but it is a stabilizer built in also. And all of my two stroke equipment, Sabre, this right here, you can run, I don't care what your equipment says, if your equipment says 50 to one, you can run it at 100 to one. They have done so many tests, I've, I've watched the videos, I've seen all the writings they put on this stuff. This stuff does a fantastic job at 100 to one. 
and and my equipment i've never had an issue out of and i've had the equipment for a very long time it doesn't gum up the carburetor it doesn't do anything like that the piston or the cylinder wall stay nice and lubricated they stay clean um, and your spark arrestor does not get clogged like a lot of spark arresters do which is an issue most people just take them off their own way anyways but um, saber 100 to 1 you can buy it in a packet form and if you just put this in a gallon you're at 100 to 1 and you're ready to go if you don't feel comfortable doing that you can still do 50 to 1. i can tell you that saber if you've ever used a two cycle um, engine of any sort especially like a blower or a weed eater when you come in the house you stink you can smell it on you by using saber and using less oil it does not smell nearly as bad on you when you walk in the house which is also another good thing about saber over here we got power foam it's kind of like that other foam company um, where you spray it in the intake you guys are going to clean your intake um, it's a great product if you have a car that's just not running right and you need to get like the intake clean um, it'll help clean the valves you spray it in your throttle body once the engine's warm once the entire can is in there and you don't want it to stall once the entire can is in shut it off and you let it sit for a certain amount of time i don't remember it's been a while since i've used it um, and then when you start back up it's going to smoke like a freight train um, but you're going to notice the car runs smoother and runs so much better the next one you guys is mp which is metal protector um, it's a lubricant that i use for all kinds of stuff it's also like door hinges and stuff. It's also a rust uh, protectant. It's gonna free rusty parts and then it, it will displace moisture as well. The AMS oil synthetic multi-purpose grease. Once again, I think I mentioned this at the beginning of the video. I use that in anything that requires grease, anything. My bearings on our trailers, on our camper, ball joints, tie rod ends, my, my, um, all my polishers, I take them apart and that's the grease that goes in them. That is a fantastic grease. It doesn't break the bank um, and is a big bang for the buck. I can tell you that much right now. And there's tons of videos out there, people doing the anvil tests with it and it, it beats all of them on the market, hands down. And they do them side by side by side and, and that is very, very good stuff. When the anvil goes down, the ones from, from around the market on the other brands are on the market they have a cup around it when it hits it just psh, splatters it out around the edge when it does the AMS oil it doesn't splatter at all and when it lifts up it's sticking to the anvil that right there showed me everything i need to know about their grease next thing we got we got v-twin oil and transmission fluid and normally i have primary fluid but i just serviced my bike and i used my last quart uh, about a month ago uh, v-twin oil is great especially if you have a air-cooled bike it's going to lower your oil temperatures i noticed that first thing when i put it in my bike um, and the other thing i noticed is how much quieter the engine is i told you i was going to say that a lot all the oils make every engine i put it in quieter uh, makes it run smoother uh, very good oil 20 w50 my bike you can buy as a as a kit um, and most harleys you can on the website that's four quarts of oil depending on how new your bike is four quarts of oil chrome oil filter or black oil filter and your o-ring to do your oil change or if you buy a newer bike i think it comes with i think six quarts of oil and your oil filter chrome or black doesn't matter what you want uh, to use there the transmission fluid for v-twins makes the transmission really quiet shifts smooth because i had a problem with my bike especially mine's an 09 ultra classic fifth gear would whine when i replace that and the primary fluid it's gone um, the wine is almost completely gone. I'm not going to say it's completely gone, but it's almost gone. It's not nearly as noticeable as it was before. And with the primary fluid, it shifts so much smoother and finding neutral is super simple now. Um, have zero issues finding neutral. I felt, always felt like a dummy on it. I've been riding for years. Um, but when I got this bike, find a neutral, up, down, up, down, up, down, until you finally find it. And I see people on hints on like Facebook, a group I'm in say, hey, just push your left toe in and then up and you'll find neutral. That does work sometimes, but not foolproof. The primary fluid, every time. Find neutral every single time zero effort at all to find neutral last two products severe gear and every differential that i own it comes with an anti-slip um, additive built into it so you don't have to add anything to it unless you hear some chatter and then they want you to add some uh, whatever your manufacturer recommends but i've never had that problem um, on when i have when i've used that in any of my differentials i've had no chatter great for if you're towing hauling doing that type of stuff that's why it's called severe gear but don't get me wrong there's nothing wrong with putting a severe gear like that in your differential that if, even if you're not it's going to help protect your bearings your gears and everything in the differential uh, it's a really good differential fluid last thing is something that you may not even think about um, that i never even thought about them carrying until i saw it one day and it is their compressor oil uh, this is for reciprocating and vein compressors like mine i have a 60 gallon air compressor over there this is the only thing that that thing has ever seen that thing runs so smooth so quiet compared to most other air compressors once again talking about quiet 
Um, it's been great. It stays clean because I have a site in there. It never looks dirty and I change it. Mm, I've not been great about it, but once a year, year and a half, maybe two years. Um, and I've had zero issues. It's still just as clean right now in the compressor as it was the day I put it in. I use weight 3040. They have other weights on the website. Now, Amswell does have more products than just this on their website, you guys. Like I said, there's marine products, there's um, UTV, ATV products, there's all kinds of different additives um, and sprays and all that good stuff. You guys just go to their website and check it out. That's why I wanted to show you on here so you guys go see for yourself. I am a 100% wholehearted believer in Amsoil, and that's why I decided to become a dealer. You guys, if you have any questions, feel free to call me, email me, whatever you want to do there. I can talk you through it. If you have any questions about a certain product, I hopefully can answer it for you. If I can't answer it for you, I will get the answer for you because I'm not going to make it up. Um, but yeah, go to the website. Um, I'll leave a description of the video under the video where you guys can find it with my dealer number in case you need it. Um, but go check it out. If you guys are interested in it, just get yourself a free catalog that at least let you be able to look at it, put on the kitchen table, put on the coffee table, whatever. Mine stays on the coffee table and I periodically look at it um, and decide for yourself if it's for you. So I want to say thank you guys so much for watching this video and checking it out. Please hit that thumbs up button. Like I mentioned at the beginning of the video, that really helps this video get out there, helps my channel grow and I really appreciate that. Hit that subscribe button, join the Fab Family. We'd love to have you. We'll see you in the next video. Thank you.